Thank you. Okay. Um, hello, everyone. Uh, so it's just uh, about a minute after the hour. Uh, thank you for uh, joining us. Uh, we really uh, appreciate it. And so I just, uh, yeah, I just want to welcome you to the uh, uh, sort of death mitigation workshop uh, that is hosted by the Lunar Surface Innovation Consortium. Uh, and so I am one of the workshop organizers. My name is Jorge Nunez, and I'm a planetary scientist at the Johns Hopkins uh, Applied Physics Laboratory. And I am um, the dust mitigation focus group facilitator uh, for ELSIC. Uh, and so there's my contact information. And I also just want to uh, um, welcome as well my, my sort of co-organizer, uh, uh, Michael Johansson from NASA STMD. I don't know if you want to say something quickly, uh, Michael, before we jump in. Good morning, everyone. Uh, really excited for the conversation today. Okay, great. Well, thank you. So I'm just going to quickly run through, um, you know, what we have here. Uh, and so again, so just some quick logistics regarding the workshop. We are uh, obviously in a webinar. Uh, so if you have questions uh, for some of our speakers, please put those in the chat and we're going to uh, try to, to uh, during our discussions and Q&A parts, we'll, we'll try to answer those uh, and ask those to our, our speakers. Thank you. Okay, so let me see if I can move. Okay, great. Uh, can we, can somebody quickly confirm that we it switched? Andrea. Yes, we can see that. Okay. Okay, perfect. Thank you. So, yeah, so the purpose of this workshop, why do we organize this? Uh, and so, uh, back in the fall meeting, we uh, had, uh, for the Lunar Surface Innovation Consortium fall meeting, uh, one of the key outcomes that came out of those conversations was the need to have um, a dust mitigation workshop. And so, so uh, over the last few months, we've Put, decided to put this workshop together. And so the whole purpose of this workshop really is to bring people together. So from government, industry, academia, nonprofit, really, and, 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 and not just folks who are interested in dust mitigation technology uh, development, but it, we really want to bring everybody together. So from uh, systems architecture developers to dust mitigation technology developers, scientists, and others who are interested in really addressing the challenges that we're facing uh, for addressing dust as we're trying to return humans uh, and, 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 of course, ro uh, robotic missions um, to the moon, right? Uh, and so one of the things we want to do with this workshop is really uh, identify what are the technologies that are already available, right? This, and so we have a nice series of presentations uh, from invited speakers, but we also have a, a really nice set of contributed lightning talks uh, to talk about some of the new te news technologies that are, are being developed, as well as uh, also identify the challenges, right, and gaps with dust mitigation. And for that reason, we have uh, these breakout sessions that are going to be happening later this afternoon. And those who signed up to participate in the breakout um, sessions, thank you for signing up. Um, and you should you ha should have received uh, a link uh, to the Zoom um, a Zoom link to be able to participate in those. Um, in those workshops. And so we, we um, organize people based on your interests that you identified uh, in, your, um, in the registration. Uh, and of course, one of the key outcomes is, is what, are the, what are sort of the uh, next steps, right? And what are areas of potential key investments and future opportunities? And so as mentioned, we have uh, presentations, contribute lightning talks, and uh, discussion sessions. Okay, so here's the, the agenda, just to run up. Um, so I'm going to talk about the uh, um, just the welcome here, and then we're going to have a keynote addressed by uh, Nikki Orkheiser from NASA STMD and uh, lead for the Lunar Surface Innovation Initiative. Uh, and then we're going to talk about uh, so we have some excellent um, presentations lined up uh, by Joel Levine and Addy Dove and Ryan Watkins, who we're going to talk about uh, some of the workshops that happened this just this last year 
uh, regarding to the impact of lunar dust and human exploration, as well as the Lunar Surface Science Workshop, which um, I, I suspect that many of you uh, participated in, in some of these. But these are gonna, they're going to provide us a great recap of these workshops about some of the sort of outstanding knowledge gaps uh, that maybe came, that came out of uh, those workshops. And so that really is going to set the stage for the next round of talks which are focused on uh, sort of NASA's dust mitigation strategy and lunar architecture elements. And so, uh, so Michael Johansson is going to kick us off uh, with the latest uh, dust mitigation strategy and updates. And then we're going to have presentations by uh, folks from different elements of Artemis missions. And so, for example, from uh, Gateway, uh, you know, contributions for, uh, for the human landing system, also mobility systems, rovers for, for, for the moon, right? Uh, pressurized and unpressurized. Also the exploration um, uh, mobility units, so spacesuit, and then of course, uh, ISRU. Uh, and then we're gonna jump to contributed lightning talks, which we'll, I'll show here in the next slide. Um, I'm very excited from contributed uh, from folks from industry, academia, so thank you for your submissions. And then we're gonna have, as we see here, the uh, breakout sessions um, that are lined up. And so we have, due to the fantastic, um, you know, response from, from everyone uh, interested in this workshop, we have moved, we have decided, uh, we have opened, uh, expanded the uh, number of breakout groups from three to five. And so uh, you should have received uh, Zoom information for those later this afternoon. And then we're gonna reconvene uh, at the end to sort of identify what are the things that came, uh, came out to the top. And so just moving quickly, here's the list of, um, of contributed lightning talks. You can find those as well uh, at the, uh, at the um, uh, program website, workshop website. And so just to quick give you an idea of uh, LSTIC, right, which is the Lunar Surface Innovation Consortium, and the purpose of that is to bring everybody together uh, from government, industry, academia, to really harness the creativity of uh, all these stakeholders to really uh, tackle some of the challenges and technology uh, to uh, return humans to the moon. And so this is a really nice network and community uh, that we hope uh, many of you are part of, and if you're not, we hope that you can join uh, to really work together to uh, tackle some of these great challenges. And so LTIC is just part of a, a huge ecosystem, right, where, you know, including leagues, survey, uh, LTIC. And so with LTIC, is really primarily focused on technology. And so there's three, there's, sorry, there's five uh, main focus areas uh, that uh, including ISRU, extreme access, extreme environment. And then, of course, here we are uh, with dust mitigation. Then... For dust mitigation, right, we're, we're, we're really touching on there's, you know, architectural design factors, passive techniques, active techniques. And so we have a dust mitigation focus group that really tries to uh, harness the creativity of, of everyone in the community to really uh, tackle these challenges. And one of the, one of the, out, one of the uh, things out of these is focus group, right, is this workshop that we're organizing here. Uh, so... Uh, if you want to participate um, for, with Join LSIC, please visit our website, right, at lsic.jhuapl.edu, and you can sign up to join, um, you know, part of, be part of the, the, our member list, and you will receive, uh, um, you can participate in focus groups, uh, discussions, sort of like what we do here with, um, with the dust mitigation focus group. Uh, and then here's some contact information for our, the different focus uh, areas. Okay. So then we're going to move on to our uh, next next speaker, 